Pacers have reached the back stretch. And they are underway. On the inside, I'm a gigolo, flashing some speed, takes a slight lead at the pylon. Southwind Ozzy is about a long neck back in second. Crunch Hanover maybe a length and a half away in third. Now Southwind Ozzy takes the lead past the eighth mile marker. Red Bank Blaze is fourth, then comes Town Gossip, and the early trailer in this short field, The Wall, is about eight off the pace. New leader Southwind Ozzy, as they come around the turn to the quarter mile marker, they get their 27 and one fifth. On to the front stretch, the nine to five favorite Southwind Ozzy has the lead. Decorated pacer, over a million earned in his career, and leading by a length and a quarter for George Napolitano Jr. I'm a gigolo on the drop in class as the pocket seat. Crunch Hanover also dropping down third. It's a measured pace through the front stretch into the wind. Red Bank blazed forth as they hit the turn, followed by Town Gossip and The Wall. Right now it's I'm a Gigolo, and the pace certainly to his liking as he comes to the half mile marker, gets their 57 and 2, 30 and 1 second panel, so part of that's the win, but that was also a good rate job for the leader. Southwind Ozzy should have a lot left in the tank. Pocket belongs to Marcus Miller, and I'm a Gigolo now Crunch Hanover, a first over mover for Braxton Boyd to within a length and a half, and Red Bank Blaze following that live cover. Town Gossip will fill in the gap fifth, he's to within five, and still at the back is the wall. The lead Still a half length for uh, Southwind Ozzy as Crunch Hanover improves. Three quarters, 125 and 1, 27 and 4, third panel. Southwind Ozzy by a head. Crunch Hanover continuing to move up on the outside. Red Bank Blaze behind that cover, and I'm a gigolo right there in the pocket. Top of the stretch, Southwind Ozzy. The lead is narrow now. I'm a gigolo up on the inside. Outside, Crunch Hanover is surging now. Crunch Hanover taking over the lead for Braxton Boyd. First over goes right past for the victory. Town Gossip closed for second, followed by I'm a gigolo. Third, Southwind Ozzy back to fourth. Braxton Boyd, Crunch Hanover in 153 and two. Well, the pace certainly looked to the liking of Southwind Ozzy, but he just came up a little empty, and Crunch Hanover first over. And what's impressive here, not only you get that Southwind Ozzy, but the uh, pocket horse, Simon Gigolo, getting the much better trip, and you watch Crunch Hanover uh, just uh, outpaces him by a lot in the final strides to pick up the victory here in race number 12. Judges have posted the unofficial order of finish for race number 12. Number 5, Crunch Hanover finished first. Number 7, Town Gossip finished second. Number 1, I'm a Gigolo finished third. Number 3, Southwind Ozzy finished fourth. Unofficially 5713 in race 12. Heading back to the Hanover Shoe Farms winner's circle. Unofficial winner race 12. Number 5, Crunch Hanover. He is a four year old Bay Gelding by Captain Treacherous out of Code 1 Hanover by Sports Rider. Read by Hanover Shoe Farms Incorporated of Pennsylvania, owned by David Ann Bags, Bro, Delaware, Phillips, Frankfurt, Delaware, Chris Giaggio, Roslyn Heights, New York. Nick DeVita, the trainer, Braxton Boyd, the driver, Crunch Hanover 5 2, third choice on the board. Nice stretch of racing for him lately. Win, show, win his last three at Pocono. Fourth win in 23 this year. Tenth lifetime with career earnings over $228,000. And a winning time, 153 and two fifths for number five, Crunch Hanover. 